All right, uh, we're up. It's the December 12th meeting of the West March Board of Directors at 7.12 p.m. Yes, uh, that's exactly what that is. Um, I'm going to be running this meeting today, with Amanda Giles. We're going to start with a call to order um, at uh, 7.13 p.m., 12.12, 12, uh, 2021. Uh, can I get a roll call, please? Um, I'll start with myself going alphabetically. Uh, Amanda Giles, uh, liaison. Uh, David Zucker, uh, prime minister. Uh, yeah, Grayson. Sorry about that. Um, Grayson Grandinetti, uh, just the OD member. There you are. And I am Michael Rodney, uh, BOD secretary. Great. Uh, that is uh, four out of seven members. I believe we make quorum. So um, we're going to go ahead and uh, hit the first item on the agenda, which is elect a new VP. Um, given the current situation at DOD, uh, I don't believe we can properly do that at this moment. So I'm going to go ahead and say um, table that and for the January BOD as they will be electing uh, a VP themselves at the next meeting anyways. Just to be official, I move to table that. Great. I'll, I'll second, second that motion. Oh, OK. I got there first. <laughs> um, OK. Uh, great. And then next on the agenda is to review and approve um, the November uh, November meeting minutes. Oh, that's because we did not meet in October. Um, has everybody had a chance to review those meeting minutes? And um, from the last meeting, over the hat, over the hat, and the bat, and homeless pet rat. Is that, a, is that a yes? I'm, I'm not hearing much. <clears throat> uh, barring any errors or omissions, I move that we approve the meeting minutes of November as uh, as sent in the instant messenger. She looked in the room. <laughs> mm -hmm. She asked, what is the fish out of the fish? Do I get a second? I'll second. There we go. You want to Great. call a vote, Amanda? Uh, yeah. Uh, I, can I call a vote to uh, approve the meeting minutes? All right. Uh, all in favor? Who's around? Aye. 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 All right. Aye. 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 November meeting minutes are approved. All right. Perfect. Um, Great. Uh, we'll go ahead and move on to old business. Uh, we'll start with David. Do you have an update on the Wells oh. Fargo? That's my turn. No, is that not correct? I have. Oh, you do have an update. There we Excellent. go. So, yes, I'm on the account. I have the card. Um. <laughs> Which is great because now we can actually like give Etom money for Dark Chore. Um, Perfect. Um, Robbie Starks is still listed as the head. Um, after the holidays, when there's time, we'll have to see about. I think myself, Ian, and Robbie get together at a bank to have them removed so that we don't run into this issue again. Um, okay. But Knowing Ian's job, he's not going to have time or energy or time until <clears throat> until after the holidays. Yeah, yeah. That so makes sense. But we're we're functional as far as Wells Fargo is going for everything we need for the near future. That's Jeez. good. That's fantastic. Yes. Um. Okay. So, uh, what is the recommendation for this one? Should we have somebody move to take this off the old business list? Is this uh, issue good, done and completed? Uh, I move no, that we no. mark this issue resolved. <laughs> I mean, so next year, 
different BOD is going to need to discuss taking care of Ravi. So I think we should table it for now. Table it? Okay. Yeah. How much yeah, of that, that is, sense. yeah. Um, with the I remove my motion is, off the table. Yeah. Okay. And move that we table the item until January. Or, I second. Yeah. All right. Uh, call for a vote, Amanda. Uh, yes, a uh, call for a vote on tabling this uh, issue until the January BOD meeting. Okay. All in favor? Aye. Aye. All opposed? Uh, Sounds like it's unanimous. <laughs> Uh, let me mark that down. <clears throat> okay. Uh, the next item on the list is my own item, uh, an update on the uh, BOD insurance. So, <clears throat> so I got a bit of a late start on this project, but progress has been made. Um, I've been searching insurance companies that cover specifically 501 C7 clubs with no employees. And I'm also focusing specifically on uh, director and officer liability insurance, um, not it bundled with anything else like general coverage, just basically directors and officers liability insurance. Um, I found four companies that look actually very promising. Uh, Insuron, the Nonprofit Alliance, Affinity Nonprofits and Travelers Insurance. Um, I spent this afternoon trying to get some quotes, um, and I'm waiting to hear the final numbers uh, from these four companies. But to give you uh, just a general update on where it's heading, though, um, for the company Insuron, uh, the median cost uh, for director DNO insurance is about $103 a month. Um, and uh, but there's some other options for companies that are floating around there. Uh, the Nonprofit Insurance Alliance actually has a, uh, a program that is a uh, flat rate for $600 um, a year. Uh, but uh, the only thing we're still trying to get clarification on is whether or not this applies to 501c3 because this was originally written for um, uh, 501c3s, not sevens. I mean, I mean, make sure it applies to sevens because it's written for C3s. Um, and I'm still waiting to hear back from the uh, Affinity and the Traveler Insurance um, as well to get a ballpark idea. Uh, the only questions that I have in terms of this, I'm pretty sure the answer to this is no, but do we, uh, does Westmarch um, as a whole, do we have a DBA name, a do business as name, or is it specifically, um, what is it, CA? What is our official? Officially, it is Westmarch Kingdom of Ampgard Incorporated. Westmarch Kingdom of Ampgard Incorporated. Okay. That's I should double check that because I also get it mixed up as Ampgard Kingdom of Westmarch Incorporated. Yeah. So um, I, I'd love to get that 100% confirmed. Um, and then I, I don't think we have a DBA. I'm pretty sure we just operate under that name. And that was just yeah. one oddball question that the insurance agent had for me. So um, if the answer to that is no, perfect. Uh, other than that, um, the more I look into it, the more, if we can afford it, uh, DNO liability insurance looks like a great idea. Um, it covers a lot of different things, uh, everything from defense costs on, on, uh, to settlements, mismanagement of funds, failure to follow bylaws. Um, it can include a lot of stuff, actually. Uh, so it actually might be a lot more um, beneficial than we initially thought it might be. And that is all I have to report on the DBA insurance. Um, I uh, will hopefully the next BOD will have me as a guest to continue to present the rest of the information, hopefully next uh, January, because I'll have more uh, information then. All right. Uh, any questions? I move to, um, I don't have any questions. Great. Anybody else? Ash Sounds like a no. Okay. I will move to table this item until next month, I guess. Cool. Call the vote and tabling this issue. We need a second. Approved. 
I added it out. Oh, and thank you. Second David. That, David? <laughs> you, you're making me glitch again. <laughs> I want to have a race. I know. Uh, okay. Shall I can? Well, David, there was a motion on the table. Did, was that a second for that motion? Uh, yeah. Yes, that was a second. Okay, thank you. Sorry. <laughs> and now we vote. I need more beer. <laughs> uh, so, uh, uh, call for an all in favor, Amanda. Uh, yeah, can I get a, a vote on uh, tabling this issue? Then walk the cups out back. All in, all in favor. All in favor. Aye. Aye. Now it's time for a snack. All opposed. Does not happy. Silence. Sounds like it's approved. Sweet. <laughs> All right, fantastic. You're doing great, Amanda. Oh, right. fantastic. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what I'm doing. All right, let's go. Uh, number two, um, we're just powering through this agenda. I love it. Uh, the Quix, uh, Quixotic Valley contract. Uh, I don't have any information on this one. Um, we have, I can give you an update. The, uh, the meeting minutes had, uh, Ian was going to attempt to configure the Adobe form, and then we would go from there. But Ian isn't here tonight to give us an update on that. So super snack machine. It sounds like we'll need to probably table that until Ian is available. Okay. Or until we can check yeah. Snack machine. Rolls on the icing. I think the plan B was if he was going to have troubles getting it done, um, I would do it a. His Adobe skills are much better than mine, so he was going to try to do it a cleaner way, and I can do it a messier way. But I think I should we should go with the plan B of getting something going. Okay, I can mark okay. that in here as well. Uh, so I'll just put David will work on uh, the contracts and. Uh, In lieu of Ian. And shall we go for an update again next month? Yeah. Okay. I'll move to uh, table this until next month. Uh, David, can I get a second? I second. Okay. Amanda, can you call for a vote? Yeah. Uh, all in favor? Aye. 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 Excellent. Sounds like it's approved. Ruby. Okay. Uh, the next item we have in old business is uh, the defunct list of lands. Um, Jody brought this up last meeting. And decided to hold off discussion until uh, this month um, when oh. we had the new monarch uh, with us. But we don't have the new monarch with us this month. And right. we're actually got a skeleton crew. So, um, Jody, uh, you're, well, you know, you're, you're, this is a topic that you brought forth. Um, are you okay with us? Well, I, I, I don't know. Amanda, it's your, your call. Your call. You're the you're the president today. <laughs> um, let's see here. Well, uh, I don't see, even though uh, she won't be taking a vote on it, um, I don't see a harm in uh, Jody presenting what she had originally intended uh, to do on this topic. Um, if we would like to get a bit of quick comment from her on that. The thing with a from the peanut from the peanut gallery <laughs> yes, right, anyway please. So, yeah. so my intention is um, going forward to audits there's a land there's a list of lands um, there's an excel spreadsheet and over on the right are the ones that we haven't heard from that are defunct mm -hmm. I love that. and rather than continue to list them in when we do audits as you no know, audits submitted, they're not active, uh, was making a list of them. And according to the corpora guidelines, checking in with them and seeing if they're still active 
Do they have financials that need to be overseen by the prime minister? Because I believe if I remember right, there's a section in the corpora that we need to go over their financials. And if they're not active for a certain period of time, then Westmarch absorbs their account. <laughs> right, holds it in trust. Holds it in trust. And I don't know that that's ever been done for the lands that are quote defunct. So my idea was to get a list of those lands. For example, I think the newer one is Aurea Saltus um, would be an example, but there's uh, the Hawaii one and a um, couple others. Fire anyway, Valley. that's never been done. So that was my idea. I have done, I've done nothing on it. Um, and I'm not sure that I have access to the spreadsheets with that list of lands anymore. So um, okay. that's my presentation to the BOD. Ooh. And now I it will go back to being a videographer. Great. <laughs> Thank you, Jody. I, I appreciate that presentation. Absolutely. Uh, all right. Uh, well, as president, given that information, I, I really feel that this issue should probably remain uh, on the docket for the current monarch to become appraised of um, and get their uh, their input on when they can attend the next meeting. Um, so I'm gonna recommend somebody motion to table that. Uh, I will move to table this item until next meeting of the BOD. I'll second. Great, can I uh, get a vote? I think you have the picture. Aye. Uh, I'm in favor. <laughs> Great. Fantastic. Uh, okay. Um, and with that, that is the end of our old business. Uh, do any members have any new business to bring? Okay. Nothing here. All right. Doesn't sound like it. Okay. Uh, so the uh, next bit of information since we have no new business is to schedule our meeting for January. A um, couple questions. Uh, Jody is currently the one with Zoom and eventually we're going to have to not make her attend every meeting so it can be streamed. So we need to probably discuss not only when we're having the next meeting but uh, how we're going to have that meeting? Um, well, I can tell you, I can tell you that Zoom is free, and I have an okay. account. But uh, whoever, David, do you uh, have a Zoom account, or I probably have a couple of them. <laughs> yeah, I and apparently, feeling. I have access to Alicia's, so I've got access to three of them. Um, nice. <laughs> now at that's, least. That's and the work one for four. <laughs> I don't know how many. I don't even know how to do so, but I've got four accounts. Um, I mean, ultimately, I don't know if any of you guys are going to run for a term next year. It'd be great to have like at least one person declare. It'd be great to have some of you guys declare. Um, When's the deadline for that? I think it was like... A, the last week of the third. Oh, it gets weird with elections. Is there, and... is there even a deadline? How about the 25th? Declared. I probably. <laughs> so by Kapoor's elections are supposed to be running the 27th of December to the 3rd of January, um, okay. which means the last minute declarations would be the 26th. I probably put a note up on the forum saying declarations by the 24th. Mm -hmm. um, okay. Yeah, at present we've got zero. Um, I'm thinking just, I, since I'm the only one who's like definitely coming for the January meeting, because I don't know if any of you guys are gonna run, um, I'll just set it for the 23rd and whoever is elected will uh, confirm that or reschedule that and well, figure out technology with the new folks. I think we have to show up anyway for next, for January, just to uh, turn over. Just to no. be like, hi, bye. Unless it's changed. 
Oh, okay. I, I don't know. Um, I was asking because, I mean, you as the stable individual right now, <laughs> yeah, would probably be the best idea to run that uh, run that meeting. Yeah, um, at least until we get the BOD elect itself. Yeah. Yeah. So I don't think I can um, declare. I'm in a different kingdom now. Right. Uh, so, but Amanda sounds interested. You want to be president next year, Amanda? <laughs> so initially, I was not <laughs> planning on joining the BOD again next year, just uh, not next year, uh, just for this upcoming reign because I wanted to focus on some other stuff. But um, uh, if if we get into um, a deficit, I'll, I'll probably throw in a letter. <laughs> the guilt will bring me back. <laughs> <laughs> and then you get to finish your unfinished business with the insurance. Yeah, that's true. And I can, I can at least see that one to the end. Um, so uh, real quick, actually, before we reschedule this meeting, I do notice one thing that's not on the old business list uh, that I don't think we tabled last meeting. Um, wasn't the website move? That was tabled until uh, David or Brandy gave an update. <laughs> okay. Yeah. So we you. wanna, we probably wanna make sure that remains under old business then. Cause I yeah. don't see that in the current agenda. And that probably should bump over to next year. Um, we need to oh, rope in Grix because he's I... got the passwords for the domain transfer. And having done that in the past for my personal website, it's kind of a hassle. Um, I know in our chat about it, there was, I think Fix dropped Grix's name. And I don't know if any of us have moved on it. Um, yeah. I don't think folks have had a chance. And, and honestly, given yeah. the holidays, I, I'm not expecting to see any traction on this until, you know, after the new year. Yeah. But um, uh, I, I just want to make sure more than anything that it, it remains in old business. So uh, it, we well, don't lose I'm bringing up the past. I'm bringing up the past meeting minutes because we removed it for a reason because we did meet oh, in October okay. and it wasn't in the meeting minutes in November. So let me just find out what it says. Um, it just, um, there was a motion to table until we receive an update from David and Brandy regarding the move. Um, so I removed it from old business until they gave us, enough, but I can absolutely add it back. Uh, yeah. and I'll do that right now. And I'll add that back to the December meeting minutes, uh, as Old business. Where are we got? Where's that? There it is, right there. And it has been added back. Bam. Cool. Um, great. And then we can circle back to schedule the next meeting. Um, David, you're really going to be the only one who's, other than probably me who is going to be here for the next meeting. Right. When in January works for you? I'm pretty much free anytime. I think January 23rd, that gives time uh, for the newly elected people to breathe before the first meeting. Okay. And time to uh, reschedule it if we have to. Okay, I, um, I think that will be fine. I don't think yeah. I'll be out of town. My, my birthday is the 24th. Uh, uh, that's the oh wow! Um, and mine uh, is the twenty fifth. Oh birthday. sweet! Mm. Happy birthday! <laughs> um, and uh, I, I I don't have any. Yeah, I'll be in town. Yeah, I'll be. I don't think I'll be out of town. Twenty third should be fine. At uh, seven or six, it had been going on at six, but due to some work uh, um, constraints, we had moved it to seven. Uh, what time would you guys like? I like seven. I'm, I'm free at seven. I'm also free earlier if um, if uh, folks feel like meeting earlier. But seven works okay. for me. All right, cool. I'll set it for seven. All right. Cool. Uh, 
Well, I think that's about it. Uh, um, unless anybody is, has any corrections to make, I think it's time to adjourn. Nothing here. Okay, we're good. I think we're 7, good. So 37 okay. p.m. 7.37 p.m. Okay, I will stop the recording and do my best to get it loaded onto the West March Facebook page when it's done. Alrighty. Fingers crossed. Cool. Good luck. Fantastic. All right. Happy holidays, everybody. Thank yeah, it's been good working with all y'all. Absolutely. Yeah, it was great working with everybody. It has been. Thank you guys for the experience. Yeah. Thank you all for working with me, too. Yeah. Thanks for continuing, Boris. Oh, yeah. For what it's worth. <laughs> it's 1030 right now. I know. Well, you know, it's late. <laughs> we, we appreciate it. We really appreciate it. <laughs> oh, I, I like to see things through. I like to see them through. I don't like to leave them half done. So I'm glad you guys allowed me to stay. And what's Grayson saying? Oh. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Looks like other conversations going on. All right. Adieu. Good night. Okay. I guess we should move to second. Everybody, <laughs> good, good night. Adjourn. Yes. <laughs> good night. Happy holidays. See you next year. Bye. Yeah. Good night. Good night. Everyone. Good night. Bye. Good night.